Speedbox. Break the limits, Speedbox 3.0 for Oli, and Speedbox 3.0 B tuning for Oli. Necessary tools. Step 1, removing the cover. Step 2, Chip Installation Step 3, Cover Assembly.
Step 4. Tuning Control You can activate and deactivate Speedbox by entering the Walk Assist mode briefly. In this case, by pressing the down button. After the activation, display shows values of 9.9 .9 or 2.5, depending on whether the speed box is active or inactive. If you do not have the walk assist function enabled on your e-bike, you can also activate the tuning by switching between two assistance modes twice. Speed box also enables you to set the maximum assisted speed limit. You will enter the setting mode by switching between assistance modes, three levels down and then three levels up. The current assisted speed limit will be displayed. The speed limit can be set by activating the walk assist mode briefly. In this case by pressing the down button. The displayed value of 2.0 corresponds to the maximum assisted speed of 20 km per hour, 2.5 corresponds to the speed of 25 km per hour, 3.0 equals 30 km per hour, 3.5 matches with 35 km per hour etc. If the walk function is not activated on your e-bike, you can change the speed limit by turning the rear wheel. The limit will be saved after 5 seconds of inactivity. If you have the B-Tuning version, you can pair your e-bike with the Speedbox app. Non-B-Tuning versions do not have a Bluetooth technology and cannot be paired with your smartphone. This mobile application allows you to monitor your performance, view diagnostic data of your e-bike, control the tuning, and save your trips. The Speedbox app home screen displays your riding data and information about both yours and your motor's power and energy consumption. The diagnostics part then shows even detailed parameters of your ride, e-bike, and battery. In settings, you may change the PIN or service password, reset the chip, set the speed warning or speed limit, and switch between kilometers and miles.